My favorite thing about Andrew, I think, is how he can make any situation lighthearted and fun. Um, even when I'm the most stressed, he has a way to just calm my nerves and make me feel comfortable. It just makes me at ease. After 10 short years of your relationship, <laughs> it's great to see you guys getting the government involved finally. The way she cares so deeply about everyone she's around, family, friends, strangers, she makes everyone as comfortable as can be. When your best friend starts to date someone new, there's always a slight fear that they're going to rob you of time that you'd otherwise have with that friend. Luckily, in the case of Reese, I just gained a new best friend in March. I love their mutual sense of humor and how they uh, play off each other. They're, they've made each other laugh, and I just that's real important in the marriage. Yay! <laughs> We're married! We did it. This is it. I did it. You guys can head home now. He's always making time for the people that are most important to him, and that's something I've always admired about. She will do anything in her power to ensure the people around her are enjoying themselves. We are so excited to add another sister to the Reese clan. Marge and Andrew are like the glue to all of our friendship. And she has a way of making every single person in the room feel valued. She developed an ability to take things on without hesitation. He's willing to give up anything to take care of me and make sure that I'm happy. You are perfect for each other, and I think you found your first friend. So it was my great honor if you would all raise your glass and wish a lifetime of happiness to Margaret and Andrew Reese. I'm so lucky. This is going to be the best day. This yeah. already is the best day. I know. Andrew and I met through mutual friends in college. My freshman roommate, Claire Lewis, went to high school with most of Andrew's roommates that he lived with in Lucky his sophomore year. And we just hosted some get-togethers and she came on in and we met first semester of her college career. In the post-college life, Reese and Marge often had to navigate some sort of a long-distance relationship, and I think they're stronger after having that experience. They've seen what it's like to be geographically apart, and it only made them more excited to finally start their life together. I'm a friend of Andrew and Margaret's, and I'm incredibly honored to celebrate with you all the union of Andrew Reese and Margaret Porter and to celebrate the love between them that has brought us all together. As soon as I met Andrew, it just all made sense that they were meant to be for each other. The way that they react to each other is just with so much love. They really are the perfect couple. Andrew says your ability to care deeply about the well-being of those around you is one of your biggest influences on him. I just love doing everything together and that's, uh, that's perfect, perfect for each other. in my life, really getting to be a part of their contagious joy when they're together, and then just witnessing how much they absolutely adore each other. Just seeing um, their total respect and admiration for each other was always so heartwarming. I knew something was very special between them because of that.
think I can speak for a lot of people here in saying that if you've met these two at any step along their journey, you've known that marriage might have been on their horizon. Marge and Andrew, so excited for you guys. I don't have a lot of advice since you guys have been together longer than Michael and I. Just keep loving each other and having the most fun as you always do and making all these memories that we get to be involved in. I love you both so much and I wish you just the best life together. Family and friends, by the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church and by the state of Minnesota, I know formally pronounce Andrew and Margaret, husband and wife. Andrew, you may kiss your bride. Since we met my freshman year at Madison, you've brought so much joy, laughter, and adventure to my life. But it's not these major milestones we can point to that make me love you so much. It's everything in between. It's the small moments. It's how we go through normal life together. The union you formed today is built to withstand any and all challenges. Through sorrow and joy, through failure and success, through despair and triumph, your bond will persevere, buoyed by the powerful love you share. I am so lucky to have found someone who values family, who appreciates the little things in life, who always seeks the next challenge or adventure, and who constantly makes me feel valued. I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you dearly. I vow to support you when you need support, guide you when you need guidance, and listen to you when you need a listener. I vow to pursue the best possible me, and I vow to tell you I love you every morning and every night. Margaret, I will forever be grateful that you walked through the door of my college apartment and into my life. I love you.